Okay, at the moment we're going to demonstrate a wool handling competition. Jim's going to be shearing two sheep for us. While I'm doing the competition, I'm going to be judged by a judge, which in this case is Joe. We're accumulating um, points. Obviously, the lower the score, the better the score. You have to see our um, buckets here, they're for our different oddment types. So our belly wools, our briskets, our stains, everything needs to be kept separate. And we'll be judged and penalised for anything that's not in the correct place later on. So while Jim's shearing the sheep, we're looking for any short lost wool that's been second cutted, and we're allowed to remove that as the shearer is shearing. The only thing we can't remove on the board is skirtings, which need to be done on the table after we sort. Well, our second sheep's getting brought out. We now need to skirt as much of our fleece as we can. Only taking off the bare skirtings. Keeping in mind that our shearer is shearing and we need to get back to get the short wool out of the first leg. Now that we've got the crutch area completed, we can head back to our table, finish skirting our fleece wool before the second sheep is finished being shorn.
as we roll our fleece up, we want it rolled nice and tight and placed on the floor in our designated area. Before we go back to our second fleece, we need to sweep around our table, keeping our areas nice and clean. And if we've got a little bit of time, we can check through our boxes, make sure everything's good there. Our shearer pulls out a gear. The time clock starts for us full handling competitors. And we're now on a race against time to get that fleece scooted and cleaned up. We're happy with what we've done, cleaned our area, placed room on the table and the time will stop.